bill to keep people safe may put thousands of pit bulls in deadly danger. Good evening, a state lawmaker wants to give pit bulls an official new name, Dangerous Dog. And with that new title would come new rules, rules that critics say could mean a death sentence for the breed. Here's Katie Kim. Dick, the state senator who plans on introducing the bill, says it's a matter of public safety. But in the words of a city animal shelter boss, it's dog racism. Meet Lotus, a calm and quiet mixed breed pit bull. This dog should get a good home. But Lotus's caretakers at the city's animal welfare department fear Lotus will never find a good home. That is, if a new bill that brands pit bulls as dangerous passes the state legislature next month. This is going to deter people from taking pit bulls, and I think that's the idea. Sue Wilson Befford is the bill's author. The East Mountains Republicans sponsor the 2005 Dangerous Dog Bill that's already on the books. That law defines a dangerous dog as any dog that has seriously injured or killed a person or another animal, or one that is highly aggressive without being provoked. But Befford says that law is basically symbolic, so she wants to give it some teeth. It is the responsibility of a legislator to assure that people uh, are safe when their children are walking down the street and riding their bikes and jogging and the such. <laughs> Beffert wants a new law to state that a mixed breed pit bull by nature is a dangerous dog regardless of whether it's ever attacked. The maulings that have occurred have all been uh, done by mixed breed pit bulls. More importantly, people who adopt or buy pit bull mixes would have to take out a $100,000 liability insurance policy. The owner needs to know in advance that if they have a non thoroughbred pit bull, that uh, the dog does not have to be provoked. But animal shelter workers say the new law could be a death sentence for thousands of pit bulls. Racism is considered despicable. That's what this is. This is racism applied to dogs. The law would also mean mixed breed pit bulls cannot be out in public without a muzzle. Owners who don't insure or muzzle their pets will have them taken away, and the owners will be charged with misdemeanors. Back to you. All right, Katie, the 30 day legislative session starts January 17th. 30 day sessions are usually reserved for budget and tax issues, so for Beffert's bill to be heard, the governor has to put it on the agenda.